Hey guys, hi, it's Julie the Creative Chica. So, <clears throat> I just wanted to show you some fun stuff I got from Jenny, from Jen Jen's Creations. We had such a good time yesterday. She was here for a visit, and um, she brought me some goodies, and I wanted to share with you guys what she brought me. So there's a bag, guys, so sorry about the noise. But she brought me this, this holder from scrapbook.com. And it holds like all your bottles, like these bottles upside down. Isn't that nice? I would love to just put all my little bottles here and they'll be ready to go. So I got to figure out which, what stuff I want to put in here. They're for stickles and things like that. But even my bigger bottles, I think would be excellent for this. Look at that. So that would work perfect. And whatever I'm going to use, I could have here. And then this is just a holder. But, you know, this could be used for something else, too, like some other holder. So anyway, I love it. That was really a cool item that she gave me. And then there's more, guys, so much more. I'm going to bring this up. And it's noisy, and I'm sorry. But there's a couple of bags here I'm going to put here. And then I'll put the rest of it on the table and we'll go through it. Um, okay, yes. Okay, so I'm going to put those on the side. Oops, hopefully they don't go for a ride. So she gave me uh, uh, these cute bags. I love when she gives me little cute bags like this from Daiso. Uh, and look what it says. So happy to share the wonderful view with you. Look at all those flowers. Isn't that beautiful? She gave me this gorgeous Nuo Drops, uh, Glitter Drops. Oh, this is such a pretty color. It is called Orange Soda. I can't wait to use it. I love it. It's so glittery. And then on the top is the color. So she put on the top so we can see what color that was. So it's an orange color. Really beautiful, sparkly orange. And then she gave me one of these little glitter glues in gold. So I got those. And then here she gave me, look at this bag again. I love this bag. Oh my goodness. And she put pretty washi. I don't even want to rip it. So, um, so in this bag, she sent me, gave me some stuff to do uh, shakers with. So here's some colorful, this would be great Easter shaker. I mean, I might use that on Easter shaker. And then she gave me some floss, DMC floss. And um, I think this one's DMC. Maybe it's not. This is, anyway, it's embroidery floss. And I use these guys for my um, journals when I make my bookmarks. So those are great to have. Then she gave me this really cool looking uh, washi tape. Let me show you guys this. It's got an old-fashioned lady. This would be great for an older uh, or like a vintage journal. That would be fun. So she gave me that. Oh, and there's some dies in here. Um, oh, this one has dies. This one's from KS Craft, I believe. Yeah, KS Craft. And um, now I'm not going to have enough room in my little basket for dies but that's okay that's a good problem to have so this is an ice cream cone isn't that cute look at that little ice cream cone um oh a cherry for the cherry on top little droplets for the ice cream here's another cone a uh, top and then what is this it says i don't know but it's like a little square thing i don't know what that what's for but isn't that cute that makes a little ice cream cone so cute and um so there's that might have to put these in a smaller bag but i will name them but i'll pull it maybe in a smaller thing like i said i'm not sure exactly we didn't figure out what that was for that one was by ks craft that she gave me and then i'll move these over oh and then this this is another this is a rosette heart rosette it's a small heart rosette and she has given me a rosette before that I haven't yet played with. Um, let's see if I can get this open. There we go. And look at this. This is also a KS Craft. Look at that. I don't even think she's used these. Look at that pretty. I want to play with this. So 
So I'm going to play with that. I'm going to try to play with some things today. See if I can get something made. Because there's so many fun. Oh, and I want to show you her card. So she gave me this very pretty. Very pretty. I love this. I probably will use that for embellishment paper. Look at how gorgeous this card is. Where flowers bloom, so does hope. Isn't that beautiful? And she wrote, Made with Love by Jenny, February 2022. I'll probably write on there. That was her Sacramento trip. Check this card out. You guys, this is a beautiful card. Look. It's a gatefold when it opens. Friendship never ends. Isn't that beautiful? And she was saying that she's a slow crafter, but honestly, it's a gorgeous card. I want to learn how to make one of these gate cards. I bet I could. Isn't that cool? I love it. Oh, I love it. And I'm going to, this is going to go in my living room, set up on my little table. I usually put my cards up there and enjoy them. So this will go there. That was a sweet, sweet thing. So now she gave me some more, um, more, uh, what do you call it? Uh, dies. And this is some bows. It's got a little tiny butterfly there. I don't know what the circles are, maybe for the centers. And then this makes, I think, a rosette. I think this is by Alina Cuddle. I can see that um, here. Yeah, Alina Craft. So that's her. Alina Cuddle is also her name um, that does these dies. Isn't that pretty? So cute. And then <clears throat> she gave me some other cute dies. And they come with stamp and die. And, ooh, gosh, I like that. Anyway, they come with the um, dies, and these are all Christmas little. They're so cute. Um, let me find, we'll do the white here. There we go. Look at that. So this says, let me turn it so we could read it. Here we go, waddling. So cute, the little, I love it, all the Christmas things. Jingle Bell Rocks. Isn't that cute? Oh, that's so cute. And it comes with a die, so you can color it. And then, oops, and then here's the dies. And I really love this. I think I want to do that for my dies. Uh, I'm going to need to get another little bin for my dies, which I said is a wonderful um, it, problem to have. <laughs> anyway, she put them in these sleeves. These are great sleeves, too. And then she gave me some more little penguins. Oh, uh -uh, you can't really see them. And... She backed them. She backed them on this sturdy um, backing. There's some more little. Isn't this cute? Look at this. You can do little. You can give the little um, uh, penguins like a little hat, or I think that's a little shamrock right there. Or a flower, but you could do anything, isn't it? So they're so cute. I want to just stamp and color them. They're so cute, and they have the dies. Look at that. She hasn't even used the dies. Oh my gosh, so sweet. So there's that. And this one doesn't say who it's by, so I don't know. But there's more. So then she gave me. <laughs> she asked me if I like cutting little pieces, and she said to have at it that she gave me the shaker of this um, little confetti shaker die and it includes oh it includes the acetate I didn't know that when I was looking at it yesterday so this is a shaker die and there's more than just that I believe yes okay so she gave me more than I didn't know okay so here's the pieces to that and then she cut out already a bunch of pieces so that's nice with good weight paper. And then there's some more dies in here I didn't realize. Look at these. Not exactly sure. That looks kind of like a... Oh, that's the top of the... Um, this is a shaker, I believe. Because it's got this piece. Oh my gosh. I haven't made this, but this would be a great tag at Christmas time. Yeah, that's a shaker. Oh wow, look at that. So I don't know where these came from. But she gave me those. And then look at this one. Isn't that a beautiful die? Oh, I can't wait. This is the first snow globe type. Can't wait to make them. I am going to be... Oops. I dropped one piece. So let me grab it. And, okay. So 
So there's that. And I'm going to slide all that back in there so I don't lose anything. And this piece here. So there's that. Love it. Love it. Love it. And then she gave me a little gnome. She knows I don't normally do gnomes, so uh, I just don't have a lot of gnome stuff. So, But there's a little gnome here, and she's got some pieces cut out already, which I think I'm going to do the grand with some of the grandkids. And then there's some thinlets with, um, oh, there's, I think this 44 dice. Okay, so I think she put a bunch of dice together in here, more than just, I think, what's in here. Oh, this makes a bag. Okay, so this makes a little bag. As you can see, it makes the little bag. This is a Sinlet, uh, Tim Holtz alterations one. So it makes the bag. It's got the numbers and letters. So let's take a look at the bag. There we go. There we go. So there's that. But here's the little bag. Isn't that cute? It's like a little treat bag. Oh, got to put all those pieces in there. Look at that. Isn't that cute? It's like a little treat bag. I love it. So I've got to play with that. Sending the grandkids some stuff. So I might play with some of this stuff. Okay, that's kind of getting stuck. So I will deal with that in a little bit. And then she gave me a couple more. Look at these flowers. Oh my gosh, I can't wait to play with them. There's an owl. And, um, gosh, this is such good, this is a really good, I think, I don't know if Sizzix does this or where she got this. I'm going to have to ask her. So anyway, this one is, uh, it's called Thinlets and it does have the owl and it has a butterfly and this Sophie uh, Gillard. So there's that. Isn't that pretty? Wow. And you guys, it not only comes with, but it comes with a bunch of, um, uh, stamps. I don't know if you can see the stamps here. They're kind of hard to see, but it says like love is in the air. Love. Ooh, I love that love one. Oh, this is so cute. So this is separate. Um, I think, is it separate? No, it's part of the die. Wow. Okay. So, um, this all goes together, which is really, really neat. And then it goes in here, and then it has a little card. I love these envelopes that she put them in. Um, here's the here's the card. So love is in the air. It's got a little owl. Isn't that cute? So cute. Put that there. And then gave me a really cute bag. I love these bags. Okay, so then she gave me this more in here. And these are two, like this one. This one is like this little house, the little B XOXO, and then the little the little uh mailbox. And this is a Lori Whitlock die. There's the little mailbox with love and all the words. And then you also have um, this one, which is a rainbow. A rainbow with clouds. Isn't that cute? So cute. Now, I don't think the rainbow goes with it. I think that's a separate die. But it's super duper cute. I love it. Can't wait to play with that. And then she gave me this little box it's a, like a treat box this i can't wait to play with now it is um half an inch it looks like by an inch or so box uh let's see so it's about a one and a quarter inch wide and then it's uh, about one two three fourths tall looks like so that would be a cute little box to make and this one is i don't know who it's by but that's really super cute and then she gave me this is like a little envelope with a little heart. I can't wait to make that. Isn't that cute? I think there's another die in there as well. And let's see what's in the back. Another envelope. Oh, like a little letter. Oh my gosh, that's adorable. 
So it's got like a little fold up letter that you put in there. That's great. I'm going to be doing that for the grand. And then um, she gave me this. And this one is by Sizzix. And it's got the flag, the am uh, ampersand, the ticket, and the little reel, like a little film slide thing here, which is really cute. Isn't that cute? I love it. So got that. <clears throat> almost done, guys. Last last couple. Um, oops. Well, almost. Almost last. <laughs> there's a few more. <laughs> yeah, there's a few more. Okay. So let me put this in my lap so I can show you. I want to do this one for the grandkids. Look. It's a little gnome. It's going to be cute. This is Easter. Look at that. It's an Easter gnome. That'll be fun. I want to do a heart one, too. Look at the little hands. Looking forward to doing that one. Okay, so then she gave me this one, um, Violet Studio. This is a little flamingo. I have a niece who loves flamingos, so she'll be getting something with that on it. And then she gave me this, and I love these. Look at these. This is a rolled flower, and then all these flowers. Isn't that pretty? And then the leaves. She didn't even use it. So beautiful. I can't wait to make something with that. And then she gave me this. And this one I know is a really good dye. Uh, my creative time. I've heard it's really a good dye. She didn't use it. It's a bow dye. Um, looking forward to making that. So smally, small holiday bow dye. Isn't that neat? I don't have any of these, guys. I'm so excited. I have some bow dyes, but not, not like these. Look at this. More bow dyes. And I don't know. I don't think there's a name. No, I don't think there's a name on these. Um, but there's some, I'm just going to write gift from Jenny, so I'll know. Isn't that neat? I'm going to play with some bows. And then she gave me some brackets. Love these. Love these. Because I don't have any this small. I have some that are maybe mm, the third one out. But And I do love to use these on my cards. So these are nice. And then I've not made any slimline cards. And look what she gave me. Slimline. Um die now i don't know who these are from i don't know if it says surprise creation well i don't know if that comes from that or not but i don't think so um and then there's another die here look at this fancy die look at that it's cool i wish i knew what who made these to tell you guys but <clears throat> sorry i don't know but these are neat i love these slim die ones want to make a card with that and then <clears throat> Excuse me. <clears throat> Look at these. These are by Waffle Flower. I've never had any Waffle Flower designs. And these are hearts. I have hearts and different, like longer hearts, different hearts. And these are really nice. Really nice. I can't wait to cut these out. And that's really hefty. She uses some good stuff to back her things. So there's that. And then a couple more. This is like a, a pinwheel. A pinwheel die. I got to figure out this one, but she, we were trying to figure it out. We're not sure exactly what that was. If you guys know, you could let me know. But we know that it goes to a pinwheel die of some sort. So that's fun. And then she gave me these, which are little um, what are they called? Like uh, ornaments, Christmas ornaments ones. And then these make a little gingerbread house. That's so cute. That's going to be fun to make. And then it's got where you place everything. Super cute. And then she gave me these. And these are uh, cute little snowmen and little uh, penguins. Little deer. Look at that deer and the bear. And then they all come with dyes. Isn't that neat? I love it. And like I said, I really like these. These say sealine.com for the sleeves. These are nice sleeves. And then, um, finally, she gave me this fun food, like, candy set. Isn't this cute? Oh my gosh. Look at all this candy. I'm gonna, oh, I can't wait to play with it. Cute. So that was everything. So everything she gave me, we had such a good time, and I just wanted to share with you guys all the goodies that, that I got. Now I have to play with them, make something with them, and, um, and then I'll come back and show you guys what I make when I'm all done. And before I let you go, um, I want to give you the scripture of the day. 
So guys, the scripture for today is in John, and it's John 3.16, and I'm sure a lot of you know it already. For God so loved the world that he gave his one and only Son, that whoever believes in him shall not perish, but have everlasting life, or eternal life. So I hope that you guys have enjoyed watching this, and um, I enjoyed showing you guys and now I'm going to go play and make something with one of these fun things and I'll see you guys in the next video. Have a great week guys.